concentrate on this game, much less other people's dicks. Human Cinep... Look, okay, well, since someone brought that up, that, that's the dumbest movie I've ever seen. That was the dumbest movie I've ever seen, Human Centipede. I mean, God. You know, they had an idea there. They had an idea. They said, you know, it's like, okay, let's take three people, and, uh, you know, we're going to show a guy and two chicks ass to mouth, and it's going to be graphic. But they go through the whole fucking movie with bandages on. I'm not seeing the, the actual stitches. It's like... It's like it's like someone came up to somebody and said, "Okay, we want to make a movie." And they're like, "Okay, this is the stupidest idea I've ever heard of. Let's let's do it. Let's crank it out." Oh, by the way, your your makeup budget, you don't have one. And so the guy probably went, "Fuck. How am I going to work around this?" And so they just put bandages everywhere. Look, I'm not saying I'd really want to see it, but I I'm, I'm just saying if you're going to make a movie, and your biggest draw is, okay, there's this crazy dude living in the middle of nowhere, and he's going to sew up strangers ass to mouth. You, you better show ass to mouth. I mean, think of the possible scenes you could have had, like when that Japanese dude had to take a shit. Just think of the makeup work there. You could have seen convulsing anuses. Some of the stitch work could have popped. Things could have leaked out from the sides of the mouth. It would have made everyone in the theaters throw up. It would have been great. It would have been great. But no. No, they couldn't fucking afford that. It's like, no, you, you have no budget. No fucking budget. Not allowed. And, you know, they could have been a little more creative, too. Like, okay, this chick, she's going to have her mouth sewn to this guy's ass. And then when he gets to the other chick, he could have had a brilliant idea. He could have been like, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I've already sewn ass to mouth once. What if I do this? Hold on for a second. At mouth to vagina. Just think of that. Think of it for a second. And then they could have, if, if the movie had gone on long enough, the whole, the whole crapping out of the mouth scene, it could have been replaced with a menstruation scene. Like, you know, hey, look who stayed alive long enough to have her period. Oh my god, it's, it's horrific. It's just awful. Fucking awful. Blood everywhere. And I, I, mean, I mean, come on. Okay, look. You got a Japanese guy in the front. You got a chick in the middle and a chick in the back. If they had really tried hard and they had been willing to push the envelope, that chick in the middle could have bent herself in such a way that the chick in the back could have totally fucked the dude in the front. I'm just saying. And then it would have looked like a crazy centipede daisy chain orgy kind of going on there. That's all you would have had to do. I mean, just imagine that. Say that guy just woke up out of bed one day, the scientist dude. You know, he goes to the kitchen, makes a cup of coffee, maybe pops a couple of Eggos into the toaster oven, you know, eats that, and then he walks down to the basement and he turns the lights on and he sees that. Just imagine the hilarious reactions. Could have had a laugh track and everything. Fuck it, why not just make this whole thing legal, you know? Like, you could have a little circus, too. Children could have come along, bought bags of peanuts, tossed it at the freaks of nature, and yeah, it just would have, would have been great. Would have been great. You know, I came up with an idea called the human tarantula, but apparently someone already came up with a human spider idea. I forget what my idea was, though. I think it was like one guy and two chicks would be attached mouth to nipple and uh, two chicks would be like attached mouth to balls I forget where the other four go I don't I don't remember I guess you need to put one like mouth to dick but then then they, no 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 wait 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 that's right that's right because I remember before, I was trying to come up with, what about the dick? you got to do something for a dick. And then I told myself, okay, instead of human tarantula, you put the mouth-to-dick chick 
and have her bend over backwards behind the guy's back. That way it'll be like a human scorpion. See? See, you see, just get this thought going through your head here. Imagine the magic. There you go. By the way, we're playing a game featuring a little girl wandering around a crayon wonderland. Let's get back to it. Where the fuck was I going? I have an incredibly beautiful mind. I don't know why you don't get naked and come over to my house already. We should be totally doing it. <laughs> right now, while I'm playing this game for children. Well, creepy children. I just don't know. Sometimes I feel like my talents are being squandered. That's okay. You can be a fish. I'll be... I'll pretend I'm into bestiality and it'll all work out somehow. <laughs> 